Hello everyone and welcome to Action RPG. I'm your host Aaron and for today's video we're headed to the world of Last Epoch. This is going to be a very short video but I did want to show off a new unique that we are getting for 084 and it's actually the most requested unique that I see on the forums on the discord and asked to me personally. And this is the custom unique that Zizarin made with the developers at 11th Hour Games. Now, for Last Epoch, the program has been suspended for now, but if you pay $1,000, you can create your own unique with the developers at 11th Hour Games, and that unique will actually go into the game. As an indie studio, it was a way that they used to fund the project, and they had so many people requesting it, that they were backlogged with uniques that they had to stop it. But Zizarin, one of the largest PoE streamers who is kind of taking a liking to Last Epoch, wanted to support and created his own unique, which we now get to see. And I gotta say, when I first, when I, I, I watched him create it, I was like, ah, oh, this might be kind of stupid. No, it is not stupid. It is actually really, really cool. Now, before I show you this unique and us to talk about it, I'm telling everybody at the beginning of my videos right now, 30% of all my views come from subscribers, which means 70% are non-subscribers. And I'm hoping today is the day that I earn that push. I hope today is the day you decide to hit that little red button and subscribe. It truly means the world to me and helps push the channel forward. But again, only if I deserve it. Okay, short video, are you ready? We're only going to look at this one item without further ado, something new. Here it is. This is the new Primalist Unique Helmet. And at first when you look at it like, oh, that looks kind of cool, but you could see the squirrel face. See the teeth? Then you got for your eyes, the armor, and then the actual squirrel's face the eyes the ears very very cool design this is what the like what this is what the 3d actually looks like at least i hope so because we haven't seen it in game yet and this is the actual unique herald of the scurry primalis helmet unique horned cowl and on here the implicits are armor and damage leached as health on hit so we haven't had a unique for this yet, so it is going to fit perfectly. Now, again, 084 is not launched yet. We know we're getting this for the new update, but I will say that the 2D art, so look at this closely right here. See the 2D art? And then the actual 3D render, if that's what this is, does not match. So I am curious if they're still doing a little bit of work on that, or maybe we haven't seen the finished product yet, but you can tell that they look different, okay? But no big deal. Let's talk about what this item actually does. And to be clear, this is a Beast Master item. I guess you could use it for Druid or Shaman, but 98% of the time, Beast Master, in my opinion. So let's go through. Armor, damage leached his health on hit, okay? So that's standard for the implicits. And then for the affixes, it can scale increased health up to 30%, which is huge. Increased minion dodge rating up to 75%. Now I've never used minion dodge rating ever, but maybe in this instance, it'd be worth taking. Plus three to summon wolf. Now you're probably thinking, why in the world would you want summon worth wolf on a squirrel helmet? Hang tight. Here we go. Converts your wolves into squirrels. Yes, converts your wolves into squirrels. And I'm so curious what this looks like in game. How like basically what does the squirrels like? What's the design of the squirrels and how big are they? I hope they don't make them super small. They don't have to be as big as the wolves, but I hope they are a decent size so you can see them. OK. So on wolf, it can scale from one to three. So if you get a good roll, plus three to wolf, and your wolves are now squirrels. This is the exciting part. Well, hold on one second. Squirrels deal 45% less damage than wolves. So one squirrel is kind of like half of a wolf. So you're probably thinking, why would I want to convert my wolves to squirrels? 
This is why. You can summon squirrels up to twice your companion limit. So if you have a maximum companion of four, you can have four companions. You can now have eight squirrels. So you're going to have your own pack of eight squirrels. And if you're wearing a couple items that are plus two to wolf, you can literally have to plus eight or higher to wolf. So you can put 28 points into wolf. That sounds pretty good. We keep going. From 5 to 75% chance to bleed on hit for squirrels. So you got eight squirrels running around and they're making everybody bleed. 5 to 75% chance to shred physical resistance on hit for squirrels. So they're making enemies bleed and they're shredding physical resistance. And then last but not least, Howl is replaced by Rage, which grants your squirrels 40% increased movement speed and melee attack speed for four seconds. So they're making everyone bleed, they're shredding physical armor, and then when you need a little extra, you hit Howl, and for four seconds, your eight squirrels are just tearing everything up in their Rage mode. That is a very powerful unique. Because the helmet does have good affixes on it normally, but nothing to the no, no rare helmet will be able to replace this. Like, because you're getting life, you're getting plus the skill, and you're getting all these different conversions on top of leech for yourself. So, I like it. I think it looks really good. I love the way that the developers at 11th Hour Games designed it, right? Because it looks like a squirrel, but feels like it fits the world really well. But now we have to see what the squirrels look like. Not that it's like a huge deal, because if they're great, people are still going to use it. But I hope they take the time to make it something special. Because this is truly an item like no other. So that's it. I just quickly wanted to showcase an item because I get asked about it so often. So now I can point to this video. And be like, oh, you didn't see this? Well, check it out. Herald of the Scurry. I want to know your opinion. What do you think of the item that Zizarin created with 11th Hour Games? Let me know in the comment section below. If you haven't heard by now that I have officially started a Twitch, streaming on Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday, playing so much Last Epoch, having a great time with the community. It's first link in the description if you'd like to go there and support. I have 16 build guides that I've created with everybody during that stream, and we've got four new druid builds coming. We might have to fit in a squirrel build. Who knows? Again, first link in the description if you like to go there to Twitch. If you haven't had a chance to join the official Action RPG Discord, please do so. We're now over 1,200 members, great conversations every day. The idea is to create a gaming community that could jump from game to game together, so you never start the server alone. Link for that Discord is also in the description. I hope you all enjoyed this quick squirrel last epoch video. Hopefully you're entertained or at least learn something. Erin, out.